Deep in the pitch black depths of the ocean, where pressure is crushing and light is non-existent, lives one of the most bizarre creatures on earth, the anglerfish. With its jagged jaws and glowing lure dangling from its forehead like a built-in fishing rod, it's already nightmare fuel. That lure, called the esca, glows thanks to bioluminescent bacteria that live inside it. The anglerfish provides these bacteria with nutrients and a safe home, and in return, they produce light through a chemical reaction. The glow attracts small fish and other prey in the darkness, and when they swim closer, the anglerfish strikes with its huge, toothy jaws. But its mating ritual? That's where it gets truly disturbing. The male anglerfish is tiny. Think goldfish-sized or smaller, usually about two to three centimeters long. The female? She can grow up to 60 centimeters, 20 to 30 times bigger. Imagine a hamster-sized male trying to court a lioness. When he finds her, he bites her. Literally, he latches onto her body and never lets go. Over time, his body begins to fuse with hers. His flesh merges with her skin. His blood vessels connect to hers. And then he starts to disappear. His eyes, fins, even his internal organs dissolve, until all that remains are his testes. That's right, he becomes nothing more than a sperm-producing organ, permanently attached to the female. She carries him for the rest of her life, using him to reproduce whenever needed. Even weirder, she can carry up to six males at once, like biological USB ports for sperm. Why does this happen? In the deep sea, mates are hard to come by. So instead of risking separation, evolution turned love into parasitism. It's part romance, part survival, and total body horror. 